I'm not saying ladle, I'm saying dreidel. More about that soon. Hi, I'm Kathy from Kathy's Chuckle Club. Join me this week on Fun Fab Friday on location at the City of Mary City Hall. It's Hanukkah. We're here for the lighting of the menorah. Exciting times, folks! Here we are in the city of Bar in, in the city of Barrie, and we're, we're here for the lighting of the menorah. Did you know that menorah simply means candelabra? I thought it had to do with Hanukkah. It does, and it doesn't. It just means candelabra. So the the special name for the menorah for Hanukkah is called Anakia. Fun fun facts about about Hanukkah. You? <laughs> Yay! And so the candelabra for for, for, or the menorah for, for Hanukkah has eight candles for eight days. The legend has it that the oil was supposed to last only one day, but by some miracle, it lasted eight days. So beautiful. And there's a, an extra candle in there called the shamash. Don't you like shamash? I love it. <laughs> the shamash in Hebrew simply means the helper, and the helper shares the light each, each day brings the light. When you have light, it takes away the dark. How beautiful. And tomorrow is December, 30, 20, December 21st, the solstice, the darkest day of the year. So how beautiful that the Festival of Lights falls during this time. How wonderful. Yup. Enjoy as we figure out what else with Hanukkah. <laughs> Hanukkah. <laughs> Okay, kids, this wall trap is going to be right over there. Woo! Right over there. Oh my gosh, what is so exciting! One of the uh, traditions during Hanukkah is the geld drop. Yes, geld means money! Woo! Yuppie doopie! Money, money, money falling from the sky! Woo! <laughs> oh, here comes some more. Who oh, wants some more? Yup. <laughs> Something for everyone. <laughs> oh, oh, no, we're not done yet, folks. Woo! I thought I'd step away from the festivities and come and talk about the dreidel. A little bit of history about the dreidel. You know, the dreidel is a game played during Hanukkah or any, any time, and it can be a gambling game. Winner takes all or some or none, depending on where the dreidel falls. So there are four Hebrew letters on the dreidel. One is nun. That's right. If it, if it lands on nun, you get none of it, like the territory. Ha <laughs> fun. If it lands on gimel, then you get all of it. You, the pot is yours. If it happens to land on hay, you get half the pot. Uh huh. And finally, if it lands on chai or shin, you have to put a piece in the pot. Ha! Imagine. Let's see how we do. I'm feeling lucky. Yoop! <laughs> the letters on the dreidel. Uh, the letters on the dreidel form an acronym for an, a Hebrew expression, which can be translated to "a great miracle happened there," referring to the miracle which Hanukkah is centered around. What did I get? Ooh, I got hey! So I get half the pot. Yoopee! Well, luckily for me, I guess, or unluckily, I'm the only player, so I get the whole pot anyway. I put the whole pot in. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this moment learning about the history of the dreidel. A little bit of history anyway. Okay, well, back to the festivities. Yoop! See you over there. <laughs> Hanukkah is celebrated by Jewish families around the world. So exciting, the Festival of Light. Tonight we had so much fun seeing the menorah lit. This giant menorah in Barry. Nine foot menorah! Yuppie! To light up the dark sky. Oh my gosh, it's so much fun. Families to come together to eat, to celebrate, to just be grateful about life. Yup! Ha 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 ha! Happy!
Happy Hanukkah, everybody! <laughs> 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 <laughs>